The political duel in the desert continues to heat up as the two candidates running for U.S. Senate prepare for an early morning debate. Democrat Richard Carmona and Republican Jeff Flake, both vying to replace outgoing retiring Senator John Kyle. And tonight, Carmona is in the hot seat after his opponent questioned his voting record. 3TV political editor Dennis Welch caught up with both candidates today about this. Dennis? Patty, this is all about Carmona's voting record in Arizona elections, in particular the 2010 cycle. Now, he says he did vote that year, but election officials in Pima County say he didn't. It was a mail-in ballot. That's all I remember. And I think I was traveling is the reason. And most of the time I use the, the, the uh, mail-in ballot. But Pima County recorder F. Ann Rodriguez says her records don't back up Carmona's claims. What they do show is that he voted in nearly every general election since 1994, with the exception of 2010. Those same records also show Carmona skipped nearly every primary since 1994. Carmona was an independent until he became a Democrat late last year, which he says explains why he did not vote in partisan primaries. But I think it's very disingenuous when I'm an independent to cite me for not voting in primaries. I mean, it just doesn't happen. Independent voters have been allowed to participate in primary elections since the law was changed in 1998. Regardless, Carmona's opponent, Republican Congressman Jeff Flake, is making this a campaign issue. If you're asking people for their vote um, in this election, then I think people should expect that you take your franchise as a voter seriously. Flake added that voters should be very concerned about Carmona's voting history. This is kind of a pattern of not taking issues seriously or not being serious about the things that, that, that face us. Now, this comes at a very crucial time in this race, as recent polling shows these two candidates are running neck and neck. Dennis Welch, 3TV.